Hello besties, as you can tell it has been a quick minute since my summer vlogs and right now we are at the back half of the spring 2023 semester. <laughs> to kick off the last few weeks, me and the rest of PISFA went to a tailgate at the blue and white game. As you can see, the tent was not cooperating. It was super rainy, but the game was super fun and we got to work the concession stand during the game to get money for our organization. It's just us messing around behind the fryers. So yeah, if you're ever at the game, make sure you come to the PISFA counter so that we can get money for our organization. And here is us throwing away that ratty tent. I was super tired after that, so I just went to bed and then on to the next day. The next day, I decided to hang out in the stacks at the library and I found this really cool mythology book from one of the universities in the Philippines. After that, I just decided to walk back to my dorm and find some place to study. So I ended up studying in the Pollock Commons. I got a little matcha latte, found a table in the corner, plugged my laptop in, and just studied for my mechanics exam. So yeah. Decided to go back to the library the next day to study. Are we surprised? And I managed to get a decent amount of work done, got another matcha latte, and then decided to wander around the stacks looking at poetry books and science books, and I found a decent bunch. Yeah, it was dark by the time I decided to head back to my dorm, and they gave me this little plastic bag to keep my books safe from the rain while I walked back. On my way to class the next day, I realized that somebody had smashed our window in the dorm lobby. Oh, and then I went outside, it was raining, freezing, and these two guys were playing spike ball, shirtless, it was freezing. And then I headed off to lunch. So I got another matcha latte, we're not surprised. And I also got this really good sushi bowl from a hibachi place in the hub. It had scallops, seaweed salad, spicy mayonnaise, and crab. And on to the next day. <laughs> As I'm recording the audio for this, I realize that it just kind of looks like the days are all running together. But honestly, that's what it felt like at the back half of the semester. So it's pretty accurate. next day, I decided to stay in the building to study, so this is just one of the little study lounges, and I have another matcha latte. At this point, my body is at least 75% matcha. And this is one of the books I'm reading, The Body Keeps the Score, and this was a little fidget that I brought with me, which is really helpful for helping me focus. Um, yeah, and this is the new laptop stand that I got. Wait, listen. I just think that sound is so satisfying, and also getting to have my laptop kind of elevated like this really helps with the ventilation, and also helps me to not strain my neck when I'm looking down at it. So highly recommend it. And yeah, these are just some of my laptop stickers. I spent a lot of time trying to find these and then trying to place them, and I'm pretty proud of it. If you're ever feeling super stressed, I highly recommend journaling. I just did that for a bit in between study sessions and also, oh my gosh, basically Reese is my favorite YouTube channel to watch ever. I love her vlogs, so yeah, while journaling, I just popped a few of her videos on and watched them. The next day, I decided to walk around the bookstore a little bit to clear my head and then I headed over to the library to study. I actually really lucked out and got this prime study spot overlooking the stacks and another matcha, we're not surprised, but it's so difficult to get a good study spot, so make sure that you grab one early or reserve a room if you are ever looking for somewhere to study during finals. I also really love how the library is this mix of old and new building areas, because I think the library itself is at least like... 60 years old but then they kind of built like these little annexes like this little modern seating area literally right within the view of the old area got more books we're not surprised at that either 
and then I decided to get some dinner and then walk back to my dorm. There were also so many little bunnies just eating grass and hopping around and that's another thing that I love about NSYNC being so close to the woods is just all of the little like squirrels and bunnies running around. It had gotten super dark by the time I got my food, and it was raining, which I was not prepared for, but dinner was delicious. And then, on to the next day. This was the day of Pispa's senior send-offs, and this is just me and my wonderful friend Alex oh, just messing no, around with Duncan before the event started. Camera. So yeah, we got Duncan, and then we headed over to the park, which was just at a really pretty location. And yeah, we set up the tables, set up the gift bags and foods, and the event started. It was really bittersweet. I didn't tell all of the seniors and the people from what our favorite memories were of them, and then just like wish them luck for everything after college. I'm sure that they will all do incredible. Love all of them. Yeah, really bittersweet moment. I climbed a tree, which I have not done since I was like 8 years old. So yeah, it was just me just getting out there, watching all the seniors play volleyball. And it was a pretty good end to a pretty sweet game. And now we are in the thick of finals week. This was before our first exam. My roommate Corinne, also my bestie, we decided to get dinner afterwards at the hibachi place that's near campus, and it was incredible. It was also nice just getting to walk around the grocery store, so I loaded up on shrimp crackers, and there were a few drinks, like mango smoothie drinks that I wanted to get, but I didn't because the girl was broke as a joke after getting hibachi. I got hibachi with fried rice, extra sauce, and seaweed salad, which was just chef's kiss. Absolutely delicious. I ended up getting takeout the next night too, and I'm not really sure how to end this video, and there are a lot of other move out vlogs that I'm excited to edit, so I hope you have a good day wherever you are, and I'll catch you guys in my next video.